Definitely. Ben, come and join me. Um, you are from Mondotica. Um, can you tell me what brings you to 100% optical this year? I'm loving these frames, by the way. It looked very nice. It looked very nice. Um, Mondotica as a business didn't exhibit here last year. Um, but this year we felt that it was important that we um, exhibited at the show. It's a very good platform for us in terms of showcasing our current portfolio, new products within those brands, and also introducing new brands to um, the UK market. Well, I'm really excited to see some of your new brands. What brands are you launching here this year? 2019, it's a big year. What's going on? We have within our collection, Ted Baker is very, very strong for us within our portfolio in the UK business alongside Jules. Um, we've recently launched a technical division, which is um, focused around the technical aspects of eyewear linked to Ducati. So the design features within Ducati are linked directly to the features within the bike as well. Um, within that team, we have Ducati, Spine Eyewear and Zubug. So they form a different part of our sales team, but also offers something different to our current customer base that are stocking Ted Baker, Jules, and our, and our uh, more established portfolio of brands. So what's quite nice is that Mondotica seems to be an umbrella that holds like lots of different brands underneath it, um, focusing on the sports kind of side of things, but as well as the fashion side of things. Um, what do you think 100% Optical is going to bring you today in terms of um, exposure? It's a very great opportunity to network with our current customer base, um, the really strong relationships we have in the UK. It allows our current customers to view um, products, brands outside of our more established portfolio. So we're introducing Ducati and Spine to our current customer base. And it also gives the opportunity to, to customers in the UK that maybe haven't dealt with us previously or for a, a short period of time, we can introduce them to, to new brands and, uh, and new designs and features within our collections. And then Mondotica, how long has the company existed? Tell me, give me a little bit of background. Yeah, the, the business has, has nearly uh, existed for 20 years. Uh, it's developed and grown rapidly in recent years. Uh, we are now are a global business. UK is obviously still a very strong market for us, and we benefit from the global business now with, with global brands, the design aspect, the team that work on developing the collection, so you're getting a real mixture of uh, global designs, techniques, styling, quality. Um, that we can bring to the UK market. And I was very excited to see that you guys stock Ted Baker glasses. I mean, I've been a massive fan of Ted Baker and what they do in terms of clothing. So to see that they had a spectacle range, I thought it was really exciting. Um, are you excited about the partnership? Yeah, absolutely. The partnership now is, uh, we've been working with them for a number of years and it's really, really strong. The great thing about uh, Mondotica and Ted Baker is we work closely together on all the design aspects of the, of the collection. So you'll see many of the features that uh, within the clothing range or their access Accessories would feature in the, the eyewear collection as well. And often we develop aspects of the, the frames that then transfer within their collection. So there's a real collaboration between us on, on development of product, both as Ted with the brand, but also the eyewear collection as well. So I like your involvement there. It seems like you've got a kind of 100% overview on it. I'm definitely noticing like the bows. Ted Baker loved bows. So there's bows on glasses as well. Um, I just want to say thank you so much for bringing this to us. Um, we're really excited to have Mondotica here. Is there anything else you wanted to share with us? Yeah, we've got, um, I think, I know you touched on Marge and you're loving your Marge uh, frames. Um, the, one of the main focuses for us at this show was to introduce two new Parisian brands. As I said, as a global business, uh, we now have brands that transcend the UK market. This is a French brand, but as a, as a fashion house, they are, they are massive, they, massive. People don't quite aware <laughs> the scale of their business. It is classed as affordable luxury. So we've tried to ensure that the quality of the eyewear collection reflects the clothing uh, and the brand's ethos. The brand is very much about um, discreet uh, branding. So um, the quality of the products, the design of the products, and I, we feel that these two eyewear collections really represent the, what the brands are about. So for us, this is about introducing a new, a new collection to our current customer base that maybe are looking for something a little bit different uh, in terms of design and quality, and also introducing this to new customers. So it enables us to open up uh, new customers that maybe we aren't working with at the moment. It's like a new aesthetic. I would consider Sandro to be chic. That's the word I think of, chic, classic, and I think the UK market is really going to like this, and I think everybody here at 100% Optical needs to get themselves down here, don't they? Yeah, I, I agree with you. Ben, thank you so much for talking with me. I hope you have a fabulous three days here at 100% Optical.